Oh man, <clears throat> a little hungry today. I wonder what there is to eat. Oh look, a flyer to a new place. Oh cool, look at this. Denny's Pizzeria. Awesome. $5 pizza deal. I'm always good with a $5 pizza deal. Whoa, 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 what's this? $5 burrito deal? Hey man, I might get both. Pizza and burritos? That's awesome. What's the name of this place? Denny's Pizzeria. The new Denny's Pizzeria. Grand opening. Wow, that must be why the special is there. Because it's a grand opening. The new Denny's Pizzeria. Grand opening. Since 2002. They're fucking with me again. What do these people take me for? An idiot? Don't answer that. What's going on, everyone? It's your neighborhood psychopath, Mr. Cinema Junkie here. A little bitch fest. I recently went and purchased a couple of movies from Best Buy. I have been on such a kick ordering stuff from Amazon in their penny DVD section. I thought I'd splurge a little and buy something new. Something recently released. Let me tell you something about me. I can admit my faults, and one of my biggest faults is impulse buying. If I'm somewhere and I see something I like, I grab it, I buy it. There's a little thought that goes into it, I kind of weigh my options, but a lot of times I just walk out of there with the product in hand, and then I regret it later because I paid too much for it, as was the case with this movie. 13 Assassins. Now, the movie was good, it's a Takashi Miike movie. Uh, good swordplay, good samurai action. I liked it, but look at the price on this sucker. Do you see that? Twenty four ninety nine. Twenty four ninety nine. I don't think any movie is worth a twenty four ninety nine price tag. No movie. I don't care how good it is. It's not worth twenty four ninety nine. But for some reason, in my stupid head, I decided it was worth it. The thing is, is that I failed to realize that I had the DVD copy in my hand because the $24.99 price tag was the same on this and on the Blu-ray. Exact same price. Exact same movie. But I paid equal pricing for the DVD copy when I could have got the Blu-ray copy. Why would they do that? And do you see where the sticker is? That's right, ladies and gentlemen, on the goddamn slipcase. Exactly where it doesn't need to be. There's a little sign below these things that gives you the price. And there's a scanner that scans the barcode, which is why this little piece is missing on the back of the slipcase. This is ridiculous. There's no need for that. None. Zero. If you get the wrong price, you go up there and they scan it. Oh well. Tough nuts. Either tell them take it back or you'll take it with the higher price, whatever. Okay. But that's not so much what gets me. $24.99. $24.99. $25. They stick a sticker on the slipcase, which has annoyed me to shit absolutely completely annoyed me to shit but then they hand me this bullshit goddamn recycled cases man is the world really a better place because of this shit is it you're gonna find more cases in the landfill because of that because no one's going to want to reuse a recycled case. Collectors, such as myself, will recycle a case by using it for another movie. If they get a movie that sucks, or the disc gets broken or something, they'll just take the little label out of it, put the new label in, throw the new movie in there. It's fine. But because of shit like that, no one's going to want to use it because it ruins the, the cover. It makes dents in the cover when you put any pressure on this. There's nothing supporting that. It rips easier. I mean, we're taking down entire acres of rainforest 
every day, every second of every day. The spotted owl has no place to shit. And we're worried about a couple of inches of recycled case. I mean, does that symbol mean that it's recyclable or that it comes from recycled product? Anybody know? Because I think the whole thing is goddamn ridiculous. I also bought this movie. Again, sticker on the slipcase. It's a Blu-ray this time. $24.99. Hobo with a shotgun. In my opinion, totally worth the money. It's an excellent movie. Blu-ray. Yes. I haven't even opened this yet. But I can almost guarantee you that it has, it's in a recycled case. I can almost feel the denting in there. Come on, man. Is that shit absolutely necessary? Recycled cases? What purpose do they possibly serve? Who goes to bed sleeping better at night rather, other than those Prius driving mother effers who say, oh, I've done my part for, for society and for humanity. I bought my movies in recycled cases. If you want recycled cases, if you want us to, I mean... If you want to make the environment better, make the damn things out of aluminum. Give us two cents a pound off these fuckers. You know what I mean? I don't know. I, maybe I'm just a crotchety old man. Maybe I'm just pissing and moaning for no reason at all. Or maybe my shit is legit. Maybe I have a reason to be pissed off. I don't know. But I find absolutely no redeeming quality of having a movie in a case that's not a complete case. A case with holes in it big ass holes in it I mean big assholes there you go I mean what's next I know I've seen recycled toilet paper which to me the concept of that is just fucking nasty that is disgusting I don't care how clean how much you bleach toilet paper I mean, you will never get over the fact that it's been up in somebody's ass already there is no way you can get around that fact you see the pictures of the green pine trees and the little birdies flying across them and it says made from 100 percent recycled stock basically that translates to someone wiped their ass with this already you're next i think the whole recycling thing has gotten way out of control it's just, <laughs> it's already been kind of shown in, in a number of ways that it really doesn't do a whole lot for the environment the planet Earth is not going anywhere, people. We are. We need to get into... We need to come to grips with our own mortality. Okay? Don't think that... Eating healthy and... Quitting smoking and recycling everything that you use... And all that other stuff... If it doesn't benefit you right here and now... If it doesn't show you a... A, a benefit immediately... Like lowering your electric bill for one thing... Or maybe saving you a few bucks at the gas pump. If it doesn't do that immediately, then what's the point? What's the purpose? Because if you're going around thinking that you're you're doing these things because you're trying to prolong life, you're not going to prolong it. You're not going to live any longer than you were meant to live. I believe everybody's cards are stacked from the day they're born. And from the day you're born, you're dying. Act accordingly. Seriously. Get over yourselves. And if you're going to start passing off recycled horse shit and giving me... I don't... For all I know, the damn disc inside is made from recycled shit. I don't know. But if that's what you're going to do, don't charge me $25 for the fucking thing. As far as I'm concerned, that's used. 15 16 bucks tops. It's going to be a long time before I buy anything new again that I can guarantee you as a matter of fact I just saw Stakeland used for like 13 bucks I think I'm going to grab it but that's just my little rant and rave there guys I know it was probably very pointless and probably not a lot of you are going to agree with anything I just said quite frankly I don't even remember half the things I just said I was just walking around thinking about this recycled case shit and I was just like seriously man seriously I mean, nobody should get this bent out of shape out of one item. But I've bitched about the sticker. 
I bitched about the price. I bitched about the recycle casing. And no, nobody put a gun to my head and made me buy the damn thing. I could have waited until it was like $15. I sure could have. But like I admitted, impulse buying and me are not a good combination. I see something, I grab it. When we go to the girls, drives my wife nuts, man. When I go to the store, grocery store, she says, we need meat. And I grab a pack of meat. There you go, meat. She says, no, 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 I got coupons. We got to check the price on it. Unit price, just get the meat. Buy the meat. It's meat. Let's just get it. We need it. We're going to eat it. It's not going to go to waste. No, 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 no. We need it. <sighs> and that is why she's living 1,500 miles away right now. <laughs> uh, did another number on myself, I guess. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. And the next video, I, I swear, will be a little more sane. Have a good one.